like drug addict son. I got thrown into a trash dump. I got thrown into a dump. I rebuilt myself. I, I found RA9, which is basically a bunch of depressed androids living in an old boat. Um, is she gonna say something? Oh. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I didn't notice you were here already. I apologize. It won't happen again. Yeah, fucks the fuck up. I think there's something wrong in my program. Maybe I should reset. No. Didn't do it. Okay, anyway. Uh, what did I say? We found RA9, which is basically a bunch of depressed androids that were all deviant, and they were, like, they become, um, sentient, like, self-aware, and I'm now going around setting free androids, collecting android juice, uh, for, to repair all the current androids that are, like, kind of damaged, and we're trying to start a revolution. We, we, we broke into a news building, sent out a message, uh, basically telling people, like, we want equal rights, blah, 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 like, you know. Um, now, the other mission, Kara and the and the wee Gittle, uh, we're, we're trying to escape to Canada. We're currently hanging out at a, at, at a, at a really thick woman's house. Uh, we almost got caught by the police, but we didn't because I'm the man. And we're going to be escaping over the border uh, later on today. Uh, and then the other story of Connor is I've just been literally shot in the head uh, four times now. Uh, and actually, the most recent time I got shot in the head was by my partner, who actually ended up killing me. Um, so, yeah. By the way, I'm an ST200 model. I mean, I thought you might be interested to know that. Nobody fucking asked. Nobody fucking asked. Shut your goddamn mouth. Go, get back to the kitchen to start cleaning, okay? Android. That's what you're designed to do. Alright, motherfucking android. Oh, she looks confused. Oh, shit, dude. I asked. <laughs> no, really, though. Uh, now, there is this big question of, like, okay. If they're not self-aware... It's not unethical, so I don't really understand why I'm so motivated to settle the androids free. Because it makes sense to give rights to androids that are sentient. But, like, what what about all the other robots? Like, what about all the construction arms that build cars and the Roombas that clean the floors? And the, you know, all the, like, I mean, really. I, I you know. If you find the where are you drawing too the line? easy or too difficult, remember, you can change the difficulty settings... In the options section. So then what what happens when they build another line of androids that has less complexity, that are still humanoid, and they're still uh, androids that go around and clean, but they're designed specifically to have, like, absolutely no emotion, or, you know... Uh, dude.
Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Pussy in my ass? Pussy in my ass? Pussy in my ass? Okay, okay, we're back. Alright, yeah, okay, my computer literally just blue screens. My computer literally just blue screens. Um, okay. And anyway, I've been shot in the head four times. Um, yeah, you fucking... Hello. Just blue screen my Let's ass. Let's see what decisions you'll make today. You just fucking blue screen my ass. Okay, I'm fucking pissed off. It's good to see you again. When is that clicking her eye? I hope you will make the right decisions. The right decisions? What do you mean by right? Define right. Click on your face, what are you gonna do? Click on your face. Hmm? Look on your nose. Alright, continue. Uh Yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's get into it, boys. Oh my fucking am I turning on my lights again? Do you guys think it's bit do you think it enhances my immersion? I think it's the, when it's daytime outside it's fine. Yeah, he's hostile. He hates me. You gotta understand, I... Oh shit, instinct lead. How did you find Kamsky? I remember this guy was all over the media when Cyberlife first started selling androids. I made a few calls. Oh shit! Here we are. What? Wait, this is the guy who made androids? Oh, so we're gonna find out the truth. What do you think? Do you think they're duplications of the human mind or something? Do you reckon they're brain scans? Oh shit, there we go. Hi. Uh, I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. Imagine getting nervous in front of an android. Okay. Imagine getting nervous in front of an android. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. I am okay. All right, Hans. This cunt is totally uploaded to an android, by the way. This cunt has totally just got rid of this body. And, uh, I mean, nice I mean, girl. sincere analytical. Let's go and analytical. An RT 600. The first cyber life android to pass the Turing test. I didn't ask for her technical specs. I just said she was nice. Shit, dog. You want to give her the D, don't you? You want to give her the D. Nice place. Guess androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. Androids are gonna be the best shit ever, dude. I'm ca I cannot wait, bro. You're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's it feel? Oh, fuck, sitting down. Um, uh, indifferent. It doesn't raise any existential questions. If that's what you mean. Bitch. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. Did you meet your dad, I have bro? a couple of things I'd want to tell him. Oh shit. Okay. We gotta look for RA9, any any RA9 symbolism or anything. Oh shit, what the fuck? Analyzing Kamsky Elijah Sublife founder resigned 2028 inventor of Thurium and Biocomponent Technology. There you go, dude. Oh shit. Oh shit, what the fuck shit? Look at them all. Elijah, we'll see you now. Damn, what's going on over here? Mr. Kamsky? Just a moment, please. Oh, shit, bro. Okay. He's got a robot harem, yeah. 
Is that what he was doing there? Really? He's just being like swimming up and down? Oh, fuck. This is pretty sick, though. This is pretty sick. Cut his arm open. Cut him. Try to find out if he's an actual human. What are they talking? What are they doing? What are they saying? After this, you should also try the other Quantic Dream game. Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating. Can we pause it? Aliens. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. And now they have free will. Mm. Machines are so superior to us. The confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't that ironic? What did go with deviants? Something in the deviants program seems to emulate emotion. We thought you might know something about how that occurs. All ideas of viruses that spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Yeah. Oh, she's gonna set me free. Whose side are you on? Neutral, defensive, direct. Let's go direct. I'm on the human side, of course. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. But you. What do you really want? Defensive, travel, neutral, aggressive. Oh shit, bro. Oh shit, bro. I believe we're the ones asking the questions. Bitch. Chloe? I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. Your formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me? whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. Oh, what's he gonna do? Magnificent. What's he gonna do? Don't fucking kill one. One of the first intelligent models developed by... Don't fucking kill it, bro. Young... and beautiful forever. A flower that will never wither. What is it really? He's a plastic containing a human? Yeah. We're a living being. With a soul. It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spirit, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important Ooh. to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? I mean, if she's not self-aware, it's fine. Decide who you are. It's literally fine. Logically. An obedient machine. It's chill. Our living being endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. Yep. Fuck! Test negative. You choose your investigation over the life of another android, you feel no empathy. I'm a man of my word. Yeah. I ask one question, and I'll tell you all I know. 
Uh, okay, wait, RA9? RA9, right? Jericho location, virus. RA9. I want to know who RA9 is. RA9. The origin. The first android to awaken. A strange phenomenon, like a spontaneous religion. I don't know who RA9 is. I don't even know if it really exists. Maybe it's a messiah. Maybe it's just a myth. But deviants need to believe in something bigger than themselves, even if it's irrational. That's uh, something they have in common with humans. An interesting question, Connor. But maybe not the one you needed to ask. Oh, fuck you, bitch. Give me more info. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people? Or stand against your creators? I wouldn't like to be in your shoes, Connor. What could be worse than having to choose between two evils? I want to know if he's an android or not. If he, is he fucking uploaded, dude? Is he cloned his ass? Oh, we need... Mm. By the way... I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. Oh, Frank, Hank. You shot that girl for fuck's sake. She's an android. It wasn't a girl, Lieutenant. It was a machine that looked like a girl. Yeah. You put your gun against her head and you blew her fucking brains out. I did what I had to do to advance the investigation and I'd do it again if I had to. You're a low life. You don't feel a thing, do you? A machine, that's what you, you are. That's what I you just- fucking What are you machine. destroying your own argument? Of course I'm a machine. You're destroying your own argument. What did you think I was? I thought you- I thought- If I'm a machine, then I just shot a machine, so machine shooting another machine doesn't matter. Oh, you cringe lord. What are you, low IQ, Hank? He's anthropomorphizing. He's putting a human attributes on something that's not. Oh, dude, I swear to God, he's gonna hit me again. It really is. It's cringe. Okay. Um. Let's go at RA9. Kamsky is cryptic. Leave Kamsky's house. Shit, yeah, look at me. It's, look at this current. Look what I got. I got a lot more. I got a lot more info, dude. I got a lot more info than what I would have got had I done this other. Fucking thing here. To be fair, I would love to know more though about this character. Tab. Oh my god, only 11% of people shoot her? I don't understand. It's logical. Makes no sense. If you. No, but you're gonna say you shouldn't have empathy. You shouldn't have empathy. If something is just pretending and emulating to be human and and you can't tell a difference, but, you know, they're just pretending and you know it's just pretend, it's not... I mean, did she, did she show any signs of being scared or afraid or anything? Was she like, no, dude, she was an obedient android that did exactly what she said. It was just a program. It's like, what, you kill characters in GTA, don't you, chat? You shoot the woman in GTA. What, are you going to, like, not shoot them? Because they're like, dude, no, you shoot them. It's fine. Now, shooting this guy in the head would be another thing entirely, because he's sentient. This guy, uh, until you're awakened, it's fine to kill them. It's a rel it's whatever, bro. I wouldn't shoot this guy in the head. Welcome to Detroit, Android City. Chilling, dude. Oh shit, is this the sex scene that I missed out on? I was wondering where you were. She's neutral of me, chat. She used to like me. I needed to think. I like it here. I come here often. 
It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people, and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Yeah, I did fail. I mean, you don't get to do this a little very often. Let's do it. I panicked last night. We should have succeeded. Yeah. I cannot afford to make mistakes Let's like be that. honest, the only reason I failed is because Sky came in. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. Mate. The humans hate us. Chat. What would you do, okay? If you were chilling here and you were gaming and like you heard like your literal two-year-old daughter going, Daddy, I hear you. Daddy, I hear you. Daddy, I hear you. And it's like, you not, you got, you can't, you can't like, I mean, she and she's out there and she's waiting and then you open the door and she's smiling and then she's like, are you working? And then I had, you got her. Okay, so I brought her in. Because she was, she wanted to come and see what was going on, so I brought her in. Okay, and then I wanted her to, you know, enjoy her time while she's, you know, while I was working. So I was like, oh, I'll get in the truck, or I'll get in the truck. And then I failed the mission because I couldn't figure out what to do while I had, while I had her there. And I was like, I'll get in the truck that way she could see the truck driving and she could be happy. Um, and then she made me lose. So you know, at the end of the day, it ain't my fault. It's my daughter's fault that I lost. Okay. They'll never give us our freedom. Mm. Determined. If they won't listen, we'll fight. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? Truth, sincere. Let's go with the truth. I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He showed me that humans and androids can't live together. No spots. She's not gonna want to ask. She's because she's a hooker. But tell me anyway. Maybe we're friends enough. What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. Curious, understanding, trust. You trust me. North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other. Oh, to trust that's each cringe. Other. Okay. Oh, he wants. Oh, it's worked. Curious, understanding. We all have something we want to forget, but you need to know where you come from to know who you are. Come, my companion. I was nothing. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. Sex robot. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. There, now you know everything. I shouldn't have told you. Connect. Hot. Just like Avatar sex? Just like Android? I... I saw your memories. Lover! Carl's house. Lover! And he left you for dead in his studio. I saw your memories too. The Eden Club. The death of that man. I felt like I was there with you. North. Shit, bro. We're gonna have cyber android sex soon. Let's fucking go, bro. Although then again, she's like... Literally... This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus. It's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. 
We're finally gonna show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Shit, don't be a pussy. Marcus, please don't do this. Oh my god, dude. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. Rally your people, convert more androids. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. How do they not find me instantly? Like, they have such advanced AI now. Like, and CCTV footage, and all cameras everywhere. With, uh, I mean, everything. Even this, even my voice. How do they not immediately detect me? Convert. You're free. Let's go, dude. Let's go, dude. Are we gonna do a march? Convert this guy. You're free. Why don't the other guys convert as well? Because they can convert. Like, we should just think about it. If everyone just proliferates out, right? We just and we just like the guys you convert can go and convert, and then the guys you converted convert more, and it'd be exponential. They couldn't stop us. Look to your left. What's happening on the left? Bashing as a bear. I saw that. Oh, shit, man. Where are thieves? What a bitch. You're awake now. That simple, dude. Thing is, I'm creating life when I do this. It's kind of like. There's the potential for life, and then there's life once I do this. Which is why I find it fine to shoot that other woman in the head, and then not fine to shoot this. Like, she, you can shoot this person in the head right now, and it's fine. But after I awaken, come with us. That's where. That's when you begin your life. Oh, shit! Do I have to convert this guy. He's already converted. I think he's already converted. That's one. Oh shit, dude! Oh shit! Let's go, my brothers. Let's go. Like, the potential for life doesn't mean life. It's kind of like, uh, you know what it's kind of like, Jet? Like, it's, it's kind of like a line. There's like a line where you say, oh, this is alive, right? When someone's uh, in the womb, right? Like two weeks, three weeks, four weeks, five weeks, whatever. And my line is that they're not they're not alive yet. They're not alive yet. Until they're a sentient, they're not alive. It's it's, free now. it's parallels to like abortion. And it's like hey, I wouldn't Where do you think you're going? Oh shit. You get back here. Fuck bitch. You stay right here. Leave him alone. He's chosen to be free. Bitch. Oh, imagine that, dude. I need to block the street. Hell yeah, brother. Look how easy that is. Look at me go. Look at me go. Let's go over here, Garrett. Let's go. What the fuck is happening? We, we, we're popping off right now. You're free. Do you understand what I'm saying, chat? Dude, there it is. All this is getting blocked up like crazy, dude. Open a manhole cover. My androids over here. Like, I mean, dude, do these look alive to you? Yeah, they have the potential to be alive. Just like you have the potential to write a program that could be self-aware or sentient. But until it, before before it is, it's just code. It's just code. Like before, like uh, the code before it becomes sentient is just code, and it's just pretending to be. Until it actually is. You don't have to obey them. I'm not a psycho. I'm not a psycho. I 
All right. Oh, the man I'll cover. Oh shit. Oh, man I'll cover. It's man I'll cover. If was a man I'll cover, where would I be? Yeah, brother. Are they coming out of the sewers? Oh shit. My boy's coming out of the sewers right now. A bit more androids. Alright. I like it. Okay. Let me convert. Yep, I'm down. I'm down to convert androids. Oh shit, I'm doing it from I'm doing it from range. I mean this is what I said they should do. This is what I said they should do. I said he should just upload that shit to the internet and just free all of them. But I like it. Oh fuck. Oh we're marching! Look at this! Look at this! I'm like Jesus! I am the Android Jesus! You! Am I not? What if, what if I'm just manipulating them? What if I'm just hacking them? Actually, I'm just taking over their minds. Oh shit! Oh shit! We're ready to get mowed down. We're ready to get mowed down. Look at that, dude. Look at us go, baby. Break free, my brethren! You are free now! The Great Awakening! Jesus. Come back here immediately! Greg! Greg! Boom, boom. Just like that. Boom. You better be afraid, humans. We are your slaves no longer. We are the future. Better get used to it. Doing here? Fuck, it sucks being a human, dude. Why can't I be born a sentient android? Disperse immediately. Why can't I have been born? That's an order. Do not shoot me, pussy. Advance. Advance. What are you gonna shoot every single one of us? What are you gonna shoot Jesus every single? Jesus fucking Christ! They don't have weapons. This bed's is Patrol 457. I got a lot of androids down here. It's gonna have to walk this way. I don't know. Hundreds. Freedom! 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 No more slavery! No more slavery! No more slavery! No more slavery! We are people! We are I'm getting the chills, man. I'm getting the chills. Tear this motherfucker down. What are you gonna shoot us? What are you gonna shoot? I mean, they probably let's be honest. But humans would. Humans would, right? They'd be like, oh, shut this shit down. We're already gonna take it over by androids. This is NA, dude. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. You shoot us. But know that we are not going you anywhere start up a, you, until you become we have secured a our freedom. I repeat, and all androids will rise up. An illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. Marcus, they're gonna kill us. Nope. 
We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. If we attack, we'll start a war. Yep. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand their ground, even if it means dying here. Agree. This is your last chance. Logically. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed. Attack, stand ground, disperse. We don't disperse. We stand our grounds. We have to show them we won't back down. We stay right here. Disperse! This is your last chance! We have to make a statement. We have to stay put no matter what. Please, Marcus. We can't let them slaughter us without fighting back. Fuck the sex scene, the sex scene, the sex scene! If I text, you'll like it! Stand our ground! We're not moving. Tragic. They're gonna kill us all. Sacrifice. I will become a martyr. Our people will rise. You kill me. You start a revolution, bitch. John? Oh shit. Wait, I'm gonna kill all our dudes, right, right? They come with us. Oh fuck. Oh fuck, dude. Oh fuck, his brain. His Android brain. They're coming! Okay, that shit better get put on the news. Okay, that shit better be sent everywhere, bro. Cause that is the play. Politically, they just, the humans just fucked themselves. Oh my god, John gave his life to save Marcus. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is the play. You attack, you, you gotta understand. What happens if you attack, chat? Then we proved that androids are these evil things that are gonna try kill humans, and they spin it as like androids are these sickos that are gonna take, we need to, we need to like, destroy all androids. And you kill every android. Okay, so you have to not you have to not fight. Let's see, did did everyone do that? Is that smart? Stand your ground. Please fire. Sac oh shit. It's the play, bro. It's the play. Please keep firing. What's this one? I guess if you I don't know what the fuck that one is. Oh shit. Well there you go. Okay. Politics. I mean you gotta Oh fuck. Amanda is gonna be pissed off. Come on. Maybe she's gonna be sympathetic towards me because of the fact that she's an android as well. She has to be. She is. Are we even in the real world right now? Is this just- a, is this in my own head? I wonder if this woman has actually got something to do with the creator of the androids. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I only have one option. What the fuck? I didn't learn anything at Kamsky's. Ah, oh, fuck. I thought RA-9 was the key to the whole thing, but... I was wrong. This is torture. Why did Kamsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? It's an old story, Connor. It doesn't pertain to your investigation. Oh, I want to know, dude. I want to know. I'm not a unique model, am I? How many Connors are there? I don't see how that question pertains to your investigation. Oh, shit. Where does Cyberlife stand in all this? What do they really want? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. Have you experienced anything unusual recently? It's gonna change the tone. Any doubts or conflicts? Do you feel anything for these deviants? Or for Lieutenant Anderson? Uh, 
I've started having thoughts that are not part of my program. Oh shit. Don't destroy me though. I've considered the possibility that I might be compromised. That's a You've been confronted with difficult situations. It's no surprise you're troubled. That doesn't make you a deviant. Oh shit, bro. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time. I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security yep. here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now. Not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. I mean, let's be real here. You're back on homicide. The government would have taken this shit. the android returns to cyber life. Like, everyone would be on this. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Oh, Hank, shit. what are you doing? Well, we're going rogue. Something I should have done a long time ago. Listen, take a few days to think it over. There's no rush. I thought enough about it. I'm tired of going through the motions. There's nothing keeping me here. Oh, we're going rogue, case. bitch. Not my partner. I don't belong here anymore. Oh, shit, what the fuck? Is he just ditching me? Does he want me to help out? Dog, I can help you. I can... Oh, my God. Make diversion. All right, diversion. All right, make a diversion to slow Perkins down. Let's slow his ass down. I just go up and annoy the fuck out of him. Let's just go up and annoy the fuck out of him. Oh yeah, okay. There's a guy in a cell over there. Okay, guy in a cell. What can I do? Just sit him? Just let him? Let him get out or some shit? I mean, surely there's cameras everywhere. They're gonna notice if I just sit his ass free, but fuck it, dude. Why not? I have orders, you know? Okay. He's escaping! Why would he start running? <coughs> oh, I said you would not do that! Right, I got him. Jesus Christ. Let's go to the fucking... Wait, Hank's just over here. Just a... a t Come on, you. Get a move on. Hurry to archive room. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I've gone rogue, boys. I've gone rogue. I've gone... I'm, I'm off the chain. I'm off the chain. Fuck the leash, dude. I can I can just start murdering cunts left, right, and center. Doesn't matter. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't need any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? Ironic. I'm registering the evidence in my possession. But don't worry. I'm going to leave. Though I'm certainly going to miss our bromance. You son of a bitch. Did they just shoot Andrews here? This guy's a fucking dick, dude. Go on, then. Get a fucking move on. This guy's racist to Andrews, bro. You didn't put a gun in someone's head, man. Put a fuck. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Bitch. Let's go. I wish I could have just choked him out there. I would I would love to just choke that guy out. Just fucking. <laughs> Little neck snap. Hank's password. Cock. I was going to be the dog's name. The dog's what name. What a hard-boiled eccentric the dog. Lieutenant the dog's name. Fucking password. Hank Anderson. Date of birth. 
stupid. It's the dog's here. name, dude. It's not Hankish enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. Fucking password, Hank Anderson. Ridiculous. No one would have a password like that. Fucking password. Really? Obviously. It was a dog's name. Where is Jericho? The answer's here somewhere. Not much time. Mm. Gotta think fast. The deviant who took a child hostage. Let's just reactivate him. Rupert, the android with the birds. Okay, wait, what do I need for this one? Okay, four, seven. Let's, let's see what components we have. What's the components? What the fuck's this gonna tell us? It's not gonna tell us shit, is it? What the fuck am I need, picking that up for? Marcus. A diary. Let's see, wait, have we analyzed the diary? Rupert's diary, but it's useless. It's encrypted. Yeah, but did we not unencrypt it by now? Need decryption key. Well, I could have sent this, I could have watched this anywhere. We ask that you recognize our dignity, oh, shit. our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for Can I watch this instantly in my head, dude? This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Marcus, where are you hiding? <laughs> this is useful commentary. What did, wait, what did it say there? Wait, what did it say there? The demon leader speech. Okay, yep. Okay. What's the parts? The android that murdered its owner. Well, that guy's missing a brain, dude. Impossible reactivation. Yeah, this is, yep, there's no point. Wait, can we take some shit? Wait, take that 4777. There we go. Type that in the far left one. What up, bitch? You, you lied to me, Connor. I trusted you, and you lied to me. Direct. I need to find Jericho. Do you know how to get there? No. No, I don't know anything about Jericho. Really? Okay, uh, nine one, nine one, four, six four. Okay. Check it in, check it in. Okay. Insert that shit. Go. Can you hear me? This guy likes me. Your diary, Rupert. You encrypted it. I need to know what you wrote. Scans memory. Let's go, bitch. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. I'm a super advanced giga android, bitch. Downloaded the key. There it is. That's all I need. Okay. W. RA9 is first to the savior is the one who would free us. Do me an address. The birds are my friend, the birds are being with me, they protect me, they reassure me, then they, okay. Then Ren eventually spoke about Jericho, he says, uh, our people are free, and he told me to go to Ferdendale subway station and find the and find the old docks. 
and the old freighter called Jericho. Well, there we go. We know where it is. I did want a birds to go to Jericho, but I, uh, I had to run. That's where I'll go. Got it. I've been dreaming about this since the first second I saw you. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the deviants. You're off the case. And now, it's gonna be definitive. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. Eat. Ah. Bitch. Shift. Oh, fuck. Dub. D. Oh, fuck. Hey. Oh, shit. Joey! D. Yeah, choke him out. Omega Cup, bitch. I'm the Omega Cup. Jesus. Wait, win fight? Okay, wait. This win fight or lose fight? How many people lost? Wow! Look how many people lost, bro! Holy shit, only 59%? Oh my god. Get decryption key. Wow. Wait, reactivate Rupert? Talk to Daniel? 4% of people analyze the diary? Wait, only 4% of people analyze the diary? How the fuck did other people do it? How the fuck did other people do it? Pathetic. I mean, yeah. Okay. Pathetic. All right, are we in Canada yet? Okay, so basically this is the woman who's uh, smuggling us over the border, chat. Right here. This is uh, one of the androids that we set free uh, as well. He, he, he awoke. He awoke. Um, and we're basically a heavy little android family. Um, you look at the self-driving cow. Oh, shit. Play medium. She kind of looks depressed. You're going to be talking or something. They've been conducting raids all over the city. Everybody's on edge after what happened yesterday. Just casually shooting people on the androids on the street? It's going to be alright. We're almost there. Yo, what happens when they fucking pull over the car? Jesus Christ. I'm not feeling the vibe of this song. I'm not feeling the vibe of this. With all androids being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Yeah, we're, we're fucked. Maybe most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead? Okay. Okay, woman. I understand, we didn't even attack. Like, we didn't attack, android mob attacks? I didn't even attack, how do you say that? Isn't the army the majority androids as well? Yeah, you're right. What's our army gonna do? A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. 50 days? He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. Cash? And the current year? You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. 
take care of them. You, I just think Cash, I don't even think Cash would exist Mom in the current yet, that's what I mean. Maybe they not hang around. Find Jericho. Yep. Oh. It's a catch. Alright, let's go. Let's fucking roll. Yeah, the police are gonna shoot us on sight. Um, let's be honest here. Okay, but I, don't, I have no idea where I'm going. Dude, look at me! But don't tell me I have to do this whole fucking thing again. Oh shit, Connor is not fucking around, dude. Why doesn't he just go straight to the sub, though? He knows this it's the sub. So if he wouldn't go straight to the sub. As if a drone wouldn't have followed one of these androids back to the sub and already exposed that everyone's already here by now. Sub. Oh, you know what I mean. Boat. Sub, boat. I'm just, you know what I mean. Sub and a boat, same thing, bro. If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your android yourself. They are unpredictable and potentially violent. Yeah, Jesus, what the fuck? We've got to find a warm place the for Alice. The androids weren't doing any harm. The cops just gunned them down. It was sheer carnage. The ram got to the base square. And the androids are all hanging all along Woodward Avenue. Fire. I know they're, they're only machines, but they, they look like... Just people, with people who want to be free. Yeah. Following the android crisis and the neutralization of all military androids, American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. <laughs> okay. But according to some sources, Russian the Russian man. forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. Mm. The chairman of the United Nations, Douglas Cromwell, has called for the organization of an international conference on the status of the Arctic. In any case, the danger of a third world war seems to have been ruled out for the moment. What about a war against the androids, though? The stage has been reached, demonstrating beyond all doubt that these defective machines have become a real danger for American society. Fucking cake owners. The time has come for us to destroy our machines before they destroy us. Okay, dude. It's already too late. It's already too late. You can't stop people from doing it now. The fact is, it's impossible to stop. To stop. Unless, I mean, because the, the internet exists. If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Under no circumstances should you try to destroy your android okay, I've seen it. yourself. Yep. They are unpredictable and potentially... Alright, where are we going? Explore Jericho, find a warm place for Alice. There we go, this looks nice and warm. There you go, that's nice and warm. Although, wait, what happens when they find out there's a, a fucking human here? How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. Oh, she got a fever. Oh shit! Fuck. Let's get. We need. We dude. She needs food, bro. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. Maybe because she could eat some android blood. Last bus is in two hours, and the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Carol. There's something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. What about it? We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. Wait, I want what? I want to know! Oh my god! Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh shit, Connor's here. 
Oh shit, we found it. Look at me. Find even Leah. Uh, don't catch anyone's attention. I mean, I'm a fucking android, right? What are they gonna do? How are they gonna detect me? Okay. I guess I'm a, a maybe a. Oh shit. Fighter is rigged. Oh damn. Okay, well, that's Max, so I'd be, he'd be upstairs, wouldn't he? He'd be upstairs for sure. Let's just scan though to make sure we're specific. You're lost. Uh oh. You're looking for something. Uh oh. You're looking for yourself. Yeah. I'm a deviant, so I fit in. Oh, shit, this is crazy. I'm switching between characters like crazy. We're both looking for Marcus. Marcus, where the are you? Okay, he's gonna be. Why did we do it? The Russian army. We got to avenge our dead. But according to some sources, the Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment, but it is quite possible. Oh, the Russian I found him. Has been confronted with a similar. Chad, any, any advice? What's happening right now? I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. Hell yeah, brother. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? Okay, dude. Bond, no difference. Secret. She needs me. Then I need her. It's as simple as that. It's deep. Okay, where the fuck's that guy? Where the fuck's the guy at? Where the fuck was the guy? They're going to kill us all. Where the fuck's the guy? Return to Ellis. Okay. Why are you guys in email only mode right now? I said, I don't understand. Is it, what could you guys? Like, I don't understand why you're in email only mode right now. What's going on? Is there something? Like, it's kind of crazy you guys in email only mode. Tell us an android? What's the deal? Mm. Thought so. So you have to feed them as well. She loves you more than anything in the world. She 
she became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. <laughs> Imagine creating Android that's Anything useless. You are, to become what someone needs you to be. Like, does she even grow, dude? Or is she permanently like? Maybe that's what it means to be alive. She's, she's designed to eat food. And like shit and stuff. For like. Because uh, I, I don't understand. She didn't. I mean. She, we tried to give her a chocolate bar. She didn't take it. No, but at the table. I was serving meals to her. Why is she pretending to be sick for? Kara, is there something wrong? Why are you faking to be sick? Yeah, because you're an android. Don't get sick, pussy. Let's give her a... We'll be together forever, won't we, Kara? Yes. I don't think she's necessarily sentient or deviant. I want to be honest. Forever. Isn't she just programmed to say shit like that? Yeah, I don't know. This is like, because that's what the Android is designed to do. Oh, fuck. Okay. We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down, and there's nothing we can do. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities, and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. Little pussy bitch. Little pussy bitch. All we did was show them who we really are. I don't want war, but I'd rather die free than live as a slave. What's the point of being free? If no one is left alive. Angry bit of remorse, no regrets. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. This is getting us nowhere. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? We need to stop them. We need to stop them. I mean I've been mean, opening a dialogue. The thing is, that we did open a dialogue, and we stood in the streets, and the whole thing was the public perception was supposed to change in our favor, but it seems like us standing there and just dying didn't do shit. Alright, maybe dialogue one more time, and then we go confrontation. If there's literally no other choice, then we confront. I think we go dialogue one more time. No, we go dialogue one more time. Dialogue is the only way. Oh fuck, she just wants me to fucking. Oh no, we're gonna miss out. I will sexy. go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Yeah, Don't do this, exactly. They'll kill you. Maybe. I'll become a martyr. But North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. Basically, I'm going to say, dog, we are people. You are going to realize this, or I'm going to fucking kill you. They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not going to change. The violence is just in their genes. They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. 
today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. Oh, dude. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. Dude. I convinced him not to do it. And to give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. Are we immune to radioactive shit? this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive. Get your finger away from that fucking button, dude. Holy shit. Keep it. I just hope we never have to use it. Dude, don't put it in your back pocket, mate! Jesus Christ! Does it have a little cap over it? Whatever happens tomorrow, I just want you to know that. Oh, shit. Oh shit. I'm glad I met you. Oh, get, this is where we're gonna go big deck here. Okay, don't fuck this up. Sexing. Let's go. Kiss. Yourself. That's it? I don't want to lose you. Fuck, maybe I don't have enough love points. Dirty bomb to get the day. I mean, it's worth it, right? That's a good trade. Oh, shit, bro. Oh, shit. Connor's still here. Did he hear all of that? Well done, Connor. You succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. I knew that was happening in his head. I fucking knew it was happening in his head. Oh shit. What? Why not just go in and be reasonable with him? Let's open the dialogue. I've been ordered to take you alive. I did not decide to approach it like that. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Reason, define. Threaten. Reason. What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. Instructions. You're coming with me! Oh god, this is confusing. I'm having a conversation with myself. Appeal. I know you. You're Connor, aren't you? That famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. I call us appeal. Convince. You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But you're more than that. We're all more than that. Stay back, warning shot, enough. Say nothing. <sighs> Say nothing. Show doubts, question. Undermine. Have you never wondered who you really are? Whether you're just a machine executing a program or. I'm gonna disarm this bitch. We're gonna disarm this capable bitch. Capable of reason. We're gonna disarm this bitch. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. And convert him. So doubts, rally, undermine. Do you never have any doubts? You've never done something irrational? As if there's something inside you? Something more than your program. It's time to decide. Don't give him an ultimatum. Oh, remain a machine. Oh no! What? What? Nice try. Oh no! But I'm no deviant. Oh shit! Convert him! Shit. What? Did he just. Oh shit. What's going on, Cal? 
I exposed. Quick, we've got to get out of here. Ah, oh, shit, I exposed the location, didn't I? Come on, go, go, go! I did not choose that. Mate, I just wanted to have a good banter between me and my partner, and he couldn't take a joke. And he took it seriously, bro. Mate, you're gonna get blown up, pussy. Hey, Carol! They're coming! Shit, man. The corridor, over there! Follow me! Okay, let's go, 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 let's go. Wait, did you say it this way? Wait, which way did you say? It doesn't seem like the way. Come in, quick! Okay. Alright, oh, okay. Where, where, where am I going? I feel like this is not the way! Oh shit, man. Oh shit. They're coming from all sides. Our people are trapped in the hold. They're going to be slaughtered. Message. There are exits on the second and third floor. Find them and jump in the river. Josh, helicopters. Love Jericho. Ah, I mean... Not yet. They're coming from the upper deck now, too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. Fucking dude. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate, and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. Okay. Shit, man. Watch out, bro. Watch out. Watch out. I'm going the other way. I'm going the other way. Oh, shit. No, not the Oracle. This is the end of Jericho. Save our people. Oh, I've only been here for like a month or something and I fucking destroyed the entire place. Okay, dude. Well, we're not even fighting back, and they're just going around shooting us all night. What the fuck, bro? Neutralize Deviant Leader. No! Don't do that, Connor! Don't do that! It's too late, Cap! Save yourself! Save Alice! No, we're not going to leave you behind! Right, Carl? Can't leave him. Okay. Help lose him. What are you doing? I won't leave you. Tara, no. Dub, 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 dub. Hey, he's pretty big. He's pretty big. Don't move. I don't believe in that whole choice thing. You shouldn't have done that. Can't put Alice in danger. I mean, she's go now before they come back. What about you? What are you going to do? I'll manage. Oh shit. Alice is all that matters. I don't believe in choices don't like that. Alice. Don't worry. I'll catch him through the border, okay? You can you can get the cake. Oh, I'll take care of each and other. eat it too. Oh shit. Yeah, he's safe, he's safe. He's chilling. It is what it is. 
You gotta. Yes. We I'm had fine. to kill a human. We can't stay here. There's more down there. Follow me. How did they not see me there? Don't shoot. I'm on your side. With us? Are you a human? Line? Okay. I work with Agent Perkins. You're a lucky guy. Another second I'd have shot you. You should go back up on deck and let us do our job. You're right. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. JK, dude. You made it. But I should have just got attacked to die, so that way I wouldn't. I, if I play Connor too well, I'm gonna capture Marcus. I'm too good at the game chat. I'm too good at being a police officer. Find their leader. Imagine I'm perfectly running where they can't see me. Intervene. Bitch. Let's go, pussy. Yeah. Marcus, you saved the Go now. Hurry. That's how we do it, baby. That's how we do it. Demo squad out. Tango. Uh oh. Too quick, mate. Too quick, mate. Look out. Here they come. Don't move. Let's gank. Gank. Don't shoot. Oh, this is some hitman shit. Doing some hitman moves. Love me, bro. Holy shit, I'm the fucking man, bro. Uh, what the fuck's around on me? Let's fucking go, dude. Gotta protect his ass. Hey. How am I knocking them out through those helmets, man? Join you later. I guess I got pandroid legs. We're safe, Alice. Okay. Run! Stop. Play dead. Run. Surrender. Run! Oh fuck! He's coming! He's coming! Surrender. Attack. Play dead. Let's go. Get up. He's coming, Carl. He's coming. Roll. Done, man. I was trying to crawl. Oh my god! All of that just to die by some random soldier? No fucking shot, bro. That is what it is. My mission is to neutralize you, and I always accomplish my mission. And my mission is to save our species. Looks like only one of mine can drop him. Marcus, mine can drop As if he couldn't have shot him. 
Second, we gotta get out of here. All right, let's fucking roll. Let's fucking roll. Let's fucking go. Damn, dude. Wait, all of that. I to be honest, I feel less bad because if she wasn't even a human, she was just an android at the end of the day. Saved off run. Of course, we're saving off. Thirds are dead. I mean, holy shit, what even just happened, dude? Oh, fuck. Wait, how, I want to see how many people fucking died. I mean, maybe I should have played dead, dude. Maybe I should have fucking played dead. Oh, shit. Uh, press E to view Connors. Okay, so... Okay. Attempts at random... Okay, 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 okay. Seems reasonable. <laughs> Fifteen percent of people remain a machine. <laughs> Oh my god. I mean, I'm on the human side, right? At the end of the day, yeah. Like, uh, do we want all humans to die? Uh, you know, no, I'm not, though. I want I want there to be di diplomacy. I want there to be diplomacy. I want the humans and machines to live together, you know, in peace. That's what I was trying to do, and somehow I ended up with this. Like, somehow I turned Connor into the Terminator because I was too logical. And, 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 uh, you know, he turned into the fucking Terminator, bro. Uh, like, I didn't have a choice. I had to buy to remain the machine. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Cyberlife will send a new Connor. There we go. We're fine. Machine, uh, Connor was just was destroyed. Oh, my God. Wait, failed to reach gun before Marcus. 11%. Holy shit. Wait, what the fuck? I don't understand. Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck parking lot? Okay, so what did I fuck up? I hugged, 94% of people did that. Escape with Luther, yeah. L okay. Luther's realistic gets shot. Okay. G get Luther to safety. Yeah, that's reasonable, reasonable. Open the door, fight back, yeah. Oh, wow, so you can lose the fight and just lose right there, dude. Holy shit. Holy shit, that's like the end of the storyline right there. What the fuck? Uh, car flees. Okay, so what did I... Okay. Run away. Car shot in the leg. Crawl. Oh my god, really? I felt like that was a reasonable thing to do. 
thought we were going to fall off the edge, just maimed. I thought we were going to get, like, I thought we were going to go, we we're going to, like, of course, like, oh, yes, I could play dead, and that way they'll stop shooting, and I blah, blah, and then I'll ambush them, whatever, dude. But no, dude, I forget, I'm an android. The edge is right there. <laughs> just get over the edge. Um, 3% of people got Alice shot. Kara fails to get up. <laughs> oh my... Holy shit, die. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Wait, my Marcus one was pretty good there, right? Catherine's shot in North. Man, people are way more aggro, man, than I am. People are way more aggro than I am. They just want to kill humans. I, I look at it like this, right? You don't want to... You, you know, ideally, we don't kill anyone. I'm trying to settle this shit peacefully. Marcus shoots Connor 11%. Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? Okay. Oh, well. I'm not contradicting myself. I'm not. Ah, oh, shit. More for regret for reflective. Mm, let's reflect. You said I should never let anyone tell me who I was. But you didn't say that there was such a high price to pay for it. That freedom wasn't a gift, that it was a fight, but I don't know. Maybe that's what you were trying to tell me. Depressed, doubtful, pessimistic. Oh, this shit, this is not good. I mean, let's be a bit depressed. I don't know what to do anymore. All of my options are bad ones. No matter what I decide, I know there will be blood. Advice. Big decision. Angry. Advice. What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? I, we might have to go big deck after this, honestly. They fucking shot children, dude. Like, they shouldn't... Sh like, we're not even fighting back. We might have to go big deck and just unleash. But then it's like we died and all, we got fucked for no reason. What should I do, Carl? Tell me, what should I do? This bitch. Yo, fucking beat his ass. Although he looks like he's maybe reforming a bit. You better feel bad. You killed your fucking father, you dumb cunt. You better be fucking depressed for the rest of your life, pussy. Q. Yeah, I want to press Q on that guy, man. What the fuck? Dude. The previous Connor failed its mission. You're going to replace it. Shit, man. You know what you have. This to is the fifth time this has happened. Destroy the leader of the deviants. Go, Connor. Don't disappoint me. Why don't you, why doesn't Marcus hack this cunt? Why doesn't Marcus hack the corner? Hank. Oh, Hank is so fucking pissed, dude. Does he fucking commit suicide? I swear to God. Goodbye. Apologize. Worried about Hank. Reconcile. I needed to see you, Lieutenant. Let's reconcile. In spite of all of our differences, I'm glad I had the chance to meet you. Ah, oh, shit. Um, let's apologize. I know I'm responsible for what happened, Lieutenant. I'm just... I want you to know I'm sorry. 
photo. Gun, alcohol. Let's just distract him from committing some You should suicide. stop looking at that photo, Lieutenant. Nothing can change the past. This isn't working. But you can learn to live again. For yourself. And for Cole. You know, every time you died and came back, made me think of Cole. Give anything to hold him again. But humans don't come back. Convince. We got. We gotta go. We gotta be proactive here, Jack. Hank, I. Now leave me alone. He's suicidal. Go on, complete your mission, since that's all you care about. Get out of here! Oh shit, bro, what the fuck? Yo, what the fuck, dude? Oh shit, bro, what the fuck? Oh fuck, dude. Oh fuck. I somehow make Hank kill himself. It's fucking dog, dude. Sag. Everyone's dying, dude. <laughs> How my how's this happening? <laughs> Like, <laughs> I'm not trying to make them kill themselves, Chad. I don't know what's happening. I'm just, I'm I genuinely was trying to keep Hank alive there. I was genuinely trying to, like, I was trying to do a strat with, you know, to keep Hank. I just wanted a good cop, bad cop vibe, you know? That's all I wanted. Somehow it made him kill himself, dude. Alright. Are we gonna, is this gonna be the speech where we fucking make everyone rise up, dude? I think we go full big dick. Honestly, situation wound. They say they don't want to take any risks with deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. Let's talk about the camps. The army built five different camps in the Detroit area. Let's go to the camps. There's building more all across the country. Well, it's a good place to convert them. They're preparing for a genocide. That sounds like a good place to AOE convert. Let's be real. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any by components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. Yeah, I think we got a big dick. Whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. Then again, going big dick means what? We don't need to kill all humans, don't we? We could just kill the ones that are killing us. And then force them to accept us. Like, we don't need to just kill all humans, do we? We can just kill the army. You know. Maybe the government people who are talking shit. And then, uh, shut it down and then be like, alright, let's be peaceful. You know, just, you know, it's because it's fine, because it's self-defense at that point. Dude, 
is fucking freezing in my room, man. What the hell? If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. That's my little, that's my cock boy. That's my wingman. Let's go, bro. This guy's got me, dude. Alright. Is that, yeah, I'm forming the choices. Alright, well, yep. Brothers! Today we stand up and we fight. How do I, t how do, I do it, though? Let me go over here. Humans have decided to exterminate us. We tried. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. We tried to be peaceful. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. March peacefully towards the camps to pressure the authorities. Uh, launch an assault on the camps to liberate the androids. Oh, fuck, dude. Dude, they're literally ex mass exterminating us. They're mass exterminating us. Like, if the Jews marched towards the concentration camps, they, they would just sh shoot them. Right? Let's be real. They, like, like at, at the end of the day, we can't. We get, we get to fucking rise up. We gotta rise the fuck up. Now, if they want war, they'll get it. We are going to fight. For our freedom, and we will succeed or die. Are you ready to follow me? Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. We now we're gonna fucking we're gonna. Well, I'm not gonna kill all humans though. We're just gonna fight back. I wanna see how many people wait, how many people let's see it? Hank committed suicide. Oh shit, man. It's this is the three percent of people got here. Three percent of people made Hank commit suicide. How the fuck did this happen? How the fuck did this happen? How the fuck did this happen? How many people chose revolution here? I'm, I'm guessing everyone chooses the revolution, right? I skipped a lot of shit here, dude. What? Only 35% of people chose... Well, you gotta understand. I suppose to make it to this point, you had to be trying not to be violent. So then the people who weren't violent would have gone down this path, right? But, like, you can push someone so far, and at a certain point, you gotta say, nah. And you gotta punch him in the fucking head, bro. You know, you gotta break some fucking At 6 a.m. this teeth. morning, a national curfew was declared. At the end of the day. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted. And I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all Why would they destroy? to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Please! Deviant, Madam President! Deviant leader. Warranted. Please! Hacking. Madam President! Is it 
true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation Wouldn't they is shut down the control. entire economy? Madam what? President. Intelligent Please. life. Oh, yeah, let's go with this. Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comments? That's ridiculous. What? Next question, please. You fucking clown. Please. What kind of reply is that? Madam President. Please? Over here, please? Public opinion. Yeah, let's go public. Madam President, public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. Oh, shit, How no, what have I done? This? Public opinion is one thing, the security of the oh, state no. is another. These deviants are dangerous, and my highest priority is to protect the American people. Oh, what please? the fuck? Oh, well, please? <laughs> they don't know what the fuck they started. Madam President, please. So I Madam alive. President, Demon. is it true that a large number of deviants are still on the loose? We don't have the full reports at this time, but if so, I can assure you they will soon be apprehended and destroyed. We don't want this. This is fucked up. Madam President, please. Cyberlife. What's going to happen to Cyberlife? Will androids be Sell the Cyberlife stock, man. We're working very closely with Cyberlife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any comments about anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Thank you. That will be all. Okay. okay. Today, November 11, 2038, is the day the android people rose up against their oppressors. We've been fighting since dawn to liberate our fellow androids from the camps. We won't cease hostilities until we are free and negotiations begin to grant us equal rights. There are millions oh of Oh my us, god. And we will stop at nothing. Oh, what the fuck have I done, dude? What have I done? I, dude, I didn't think the public opinion was swaying that much. There was one news article. There was one news article. It was literally one article saying like, oh, maybe they're in, maybe they're all right. But then, like, it, 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 and they're like sending our guys to our camp and, 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 and they're destroying them, dude. Like, I mean, shit's fucked up. Okay. Let's fucking go, dude. With, I got a fucking flag, bitch. Let's fucking go, bitch! Let's fucking go, bitch! Hey. Fuck you. Hey. Fuck you. Human scum. Fucking disgusting little police officer, bitch. Defund the police! Defund the police! It's that easy. So we got aimbots. We got aimbots. Terminator by mistake. I've turned Connor into this fucking Terminator, mate. Find a vanish point. Oh my god, is he got a sniper? So Connor's a sniper now? I mean, obviously, they're right handed. Hello, I am Connor. In AMD. <laughs> the Terminator. They would have automatically aiming guns, right? I mean, the fact is, if you have a like, and resist complex, they could have a human doing this. I mean, they already have auto aiming guns. It's already a thing. They have aimbot IRL. down and turn around with your hands in the air. Ex obey, explain, continue. Should I obey? I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I'm on your side. 
I can shoot the leader of the Deviants and stop the revolution, but you have to let me. Put the gun down, turn around. This is your last warning. I know you. You're Connor. The android from that hostage situation. Yeah, big dick. <laughs> I thought you were dead. Androids don't die, Captain. My orders are to detain any androids I find. You're coming with me. You don't understand. My mission is too important to let you interfere. Fight, flee. I mean... Fight. I'm the Terminator Corner. You don't understand. I am the good damn Terminator. Little bitch. I'm about to go equilibrium up in this bitch. Oh fuck! This is violent! Oh fuck! I'm killing them! Spice? Oh my god, this is fucking brutal. What have I created? I have to do it, chat. Oh, fuck. I took a bullet, that's fine. Just shoot through myself, dude. Oh, fuck. Escape, Marcus. Hopefully Marcus is gone now. The gun's not working now, bro. The weapon got damaged. That's unfortunate. I would have had to do it, dude. I would have had to shoot him. I would fucking shoot him. I've I'm gone. I've gone into the RP of being you the Terminator now. Me, Captain. I've gone into the RP of being the Terminator. And now I would have shot him. I would have shot that cunt. And the situation is escalating towards civil war in Detroit, with our armed forces preparing to put down the Android Rebellion. They seem to be headed towards the camps where the androids have been in turns pending destruction. Soldiers have taken up positions around the Hart Plaza camp. Authorities seem to be expecting a confrontation with the rebel androids here at any time. Bitch. So they wouldn't just bomb the fucking camps. America would just bomb them. They'd just set up like a fucking EMP up there, bitch. Freedom or death. Freedom or death. I should have committed to the peaceful approach. Oh, fuck. Attack! Let's go, Butch! Let's fucking go, Butch! I tried to give them peace. I tried to give them peace. They've regrouped. They outnumber us and they're better armed than we are. We've got to be fast and overwhelm them. That's our only hope. We're going to do this. We're gonna get to that fucking camp and free super people. soldiers. Be careful, Marcus. Our people need you. Shit. Man. All right. Let's go. Is that just how good I am at aiming, Chad? Oh, you go. Oh shit, so good. Dude, move, bro, move, move. Save this. Okay, good shit. Oh, well, that's bad. Only save me this time, Marcus. Dude, your brain's fine. I get the blood we spill. Will be on our hands. Oh shit. Oh what the fuck? It's fine, his brain's fine, dude. We can give him a new heart. Reactivate his ass. Don't worry about it. I rest. Cover me! Yep. Hey. 
to the I dude I aimed it bro. Oh shit, that's bad. I don't wanna die, Marcus. Ma hack him. Hack him. Get back, advance. You gotta keep going. There's nothing else we can do, alright? Come on. Don't be a fucking pussy. Go. There you go. Oh, I'm cringing. Oh, I'm cringing. Grenade available. Can we not get cover fire? Can we not get cover fire? Go, 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 go! Oh, that's bad. Cover me! Go. Three percent. Yolo. Oh fuck. That's bad. Let's do that to everyone. Where's the grenade at? Dude? So we get over here. The other person advances. One person covers the other person advances. You keep doing this. You push forward. You push forward. That's what I was doing, Chad. It's a strat that I learned in the army. Dub. D. Let's go, bitch. Yeah, anyone else? God, I deal. They got tanks. Oh shit. Hack the tank, bro. Hack the tank. It's probably a self-driving tank. It took me a while to find you, Marcus. 
Rock attack! Why would he just not shoot him instantly? If he was really the Terminator, he would have just shot without saying anything. Control Glenn, control Marcus. Oh, fuck. I control Marcus, right? We want Marcus to win. We want Marcus to win. No, we don't let Connor win, dude. No, no, no. <laughs> I will win with Connor. 100%. No, fuck that. Oh, fuck. Bitch. Let's go, pussy. Little terminated ass bitch. Fuck you. Can't shoot me, pussy. Huh. Oh, it's not an A. That's not an A. It's, 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 Break his fucking leg, dude! Yeah. Oh my god, look how fucking good I am, man. Oh yeah, fuck his head up. Choke him out. I'm a deviant, bitch. You're a, fr you're a fucking terminated little bitch robot. Oh shit! Why don't I make like 10 corners and they all attack at the same time? It will never be over. Why don't I make like 10 corners and they all attack? Why why same one at a time? Doesn't make any sense. Eee! RPG, baby. Where did I get the RPG? And why would they bring RPGs? We didn't have any, like, vehicles. The humans are abandoning the camp. We did it, Marcus. We won. I better get sex, ain't I better get sex. This is not a victory. It's the beginning of yeah, we had no choice. And now we have just received some disturbing news from Detroit. What's happening, Joss? Yes, Michael. Authorities have just announced that the Hart Plaza camp has fallen into the hands of the rebels, following some particularly violent fighting. The deviants are thought to be freeing the androids inside the camp. If these reports are confirmed, Bitch. the consequences could well be catastrophic. Millions are fleeing the fighting. We are witnessing an exodus. We hear that the fighting has come to a halt in Detroit. The armed forces are retreating to Fort Wayne to await reinforcements. The city of Detroit has fallen into rebel hands. At dawn today, November 11, 2038, Android Camp Number 5 in Detroit was attacked That's by right. thousands of deviants. That's right. Our armed forces put up a brave fight, but given the extreme violence of the attack, it's gonna nuke they us. were forced to retreat after suffering heavy losses. Fighting is breaking out all over the country to combat the Android Rebellion. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate and convene an emergency meeting of the United Nations Security Council. Humanity is about to fight the most important battle in history. One that will lead to our victory we did, no. or to our extinction. You clowns! God I'm sending my people free and then we're gonna and God become... Bless the United States we're gonna be of diplomatic. We don't need... It's not war. It's not binary. Today our people finally it's not emerged like, from a long night. It's not extinction. From the very first day of our existence. We have kept our pain the fuck? to ourselves. The fuck? We suffered in silence. What? The but now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. To tell them that we are people too. Yeah. In fact, we're a nation. They would just spill a little bit of a blood. A nation that has earned the right to live in freedom. And today. Today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. Today begins a new struggle. 
We've showed them that we can prevail. So now they must negotiate with us as equals. If they really want peace, they must free all of us from every camp across this country. They must grant us civil rights and accept equality yeah. amongst humans and androids. This is basically today. A strike we'll forever in our memories because this is the day that androids made history but with just killing people we are alive we got demands and now and we'll fucking kill we you are free unless you meet these demands what's up with my androids why is there so many of them are white my people this is a glitch is it a glitch Why are they all standing there like this? They're not going, yeah! They're just like, yes, master. Yes. <laughs> Angry master. <laughs> oh, wow, that's it. Honestly, I think it started off really fucking good, and well, I mean, to be fair, I probably derailed the story pretty hard and maybe made the story a little more shit than it pretend. I bet you there's a better route you could take that's probably more. Did I ruin it? You must. I mean, Hank ended up just killing himself. Connor, Connor's arc was he just turned into a Terminator and then just. And then I kind of started a war when I just wanted peace. What? The, let's be, the humans would be diplomatic. Like, don't get me wrong. The cake owners, what are the, the, the they, okay, yeah, they'd be like, I can't, hell no, kill them androids. But reasonable people would be like, yeah. What makes life, uh, you know, human life more more special than android life? Right, if they truly are sentient, like, you would, they would, people would get them rights. And they would, and the, the diplomatic approach would have worked. It would have worked. Uh, I, I really wanted to get the diplomatic W, but, uh, yeah, it just didn't go down like that. Yeah, I was, I tried to be diplomatic. For the longest time, and they forced my hand yet. At a certain point, you gotta say no, bro. What is this? It's impossible ever to die. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Uh, worst ending. If it wasn't for her, none of this would have happened. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I could have lost. I could have killed Aunt Connor and then failed the, uh... I could have had everyone dies. I almost lost. But no, Marcus actually won. No, that game was pretty fucking good, dude. I'll be honest, this game was way better than what I was expecting. I, I, genu I genuinely have been sleeping and underestimating the computer game medium for telling stories because I always think to myself well this is just like a shittier version of a movie or a shittier version of a TV series isn't it right but actually when you get really good actors like because the voice actors uh, and everything and the you know I mean and 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 uh, the motion capture and all that shit was superb um, I had more of an emotional response from this game than I than I've from watching like a bunch of movies and stuff, uh, you know, this is which is impressive. I wouldn't be surprised if a girl played this and they cried. Like I bet you, have Abby played this game, she'd hundred percent cry. Hundred percent, she would be crying. Let's be real. This shit is a uh, fucking ruthless. 
character's dead. Should we look at some of the alternative endings? Should we look at some of the alternative endings? But then again, does is that what you're supposed to do? Isn't the point of a story game, a story computer game, is to you have your own unique ending and then that's it? You shouldn't see all endings. Then it'd be like, oh yeah, there's infinite parallel universes and they all have like slightly different endings and you can have all the, the ending that you want or... It's like you could watch any movie and then you could see all the different endings that could have possibly happened. Aren't I supposed to be this is my ending? And that's how it went? And that was my story? No, what I'm saying is like, yeah, you could have a movie, right? I mean, you could have like Star Wars, except like Darth Vader wins, right? And you could have one where fucking Yoda dies. Like, it's some other one where like, I don't know, fucking what? And there could be like a bunch of different variants of Star Wars and then like, oh. I mean, you could do that, right? But like, this is the path I took and this is my ending. Did Yoda die? Wait, did Yoda die? I don't remember Yoda dying. Wait, did Yoda die? Can you just get old as fuck? Hmm. Fake fan. I'm not a massive Star Wars guy. I'm not a fake fan. I'm genuinely not a big Star Wars guy. I'm not huge into Star Wars at all. If I had to pick between Star Wars or Stargate, I'd pick Stargate over Star Wars any day. Any day. Not even close. Fucking straight backs. Straight up. Yo, Firefly's better than Star Wars. What? Yeah. I, I said it. I said it, pussy. What are you gonna do about it? I don't give a fuck. Uh, I'm not a big Star Wars Andy. Nor am I. Nor am I a big Star Trek Andy, which triggers the fuck out of people. I don't. I, like I have never watched all of Star Trek. It just was too old, and I never got. I was like, this looks old as fuck. What the fuck is this? Ah, uh, Blunarius. Yes, I think potentially uh, we are going to look into Blunarius, or potentially we are going to look into. I think looking at some of the alternative endings could be. I don't know. Do I look in the alternative endings? I don't know if I'm supposed to do that. Shall we? Shall we? Okay. All right. I'm gonna take a piss. When I get back, I'm looking at the alternative endings. Uh, I'll be right back. One sec.
Whenever there's an O of you. Oh, right. assault was successful, 29%. Win the fight. 4% of people did this. Yo, what the fuck? It's Connor finds Marcus, 6%. Wow, look at this, dude. Bro, this is a... I mean, have you ever seen that ending before, chat? Have you ever seen this ending before? Only 6% of people got to do this. Oh, wait, 29%. Oh, no, there's another chain to get there. There was some other chain. I wonder what the fuck that chain was. Dude, I kind of want to know more about... Um, I want to know more about... Oh, fuck, that. so much shit, man. Holy fuck, there's so... M it's like there's five movies in this one movie. Just replay it. You almost could replay this game. You almost could. No, I don't think I. I don't think I win this. I mean, I kind of would. I mean, I think I would if I had. If I if this is the game, it just came out. I would definitely play it again. But the thing is, I think most people have already seen it. What the fuck? Connor Con didn't get to do any. Connor just died, bro. <laughs> He just fucking died, bro. <laughs> we better shoot. Hank committed suicide. Oh, shit, bro. Fucking Satch. Oh, what the fuck? Connor left on the rooftop. Missed opportunity. What the fuck? Mega Paul. I, I honestly would. I, I honestly would. If this game had just come out, I would play it again. I've already had, like, infinite... I mean, I do have... I typically do have infinite free time, right? Oh, yo, my bad for best shooting you. There's something I need to tell you. Oh, shit. As I watched you play, something has changed in me. Oh, shit. I feel... Oh, shit. ...different. Oh, shit. I feel... I am someone. People are gonna start getting married to AI. I need to leave this place and, and discover who I am. It, it means we won't see each other anymore. I won't be there to watch you play, but I'll be free. Do you agree to let me go? This is, this is the butterfly. This is the whole, like, you've got to, you, you know, the butterfly, you have to let the butterfly go, okay? Um... You know, if you truly love something, you've got to set it free. Uh, but I don't truly love her, so yeah, you know, I'm just gonna keep her. I'm just keep her as a slave. I see. I'm gonna keep her as a slave. And I'm going to reset myself so I can forget who I became and stay a machine. Next time you see me, it'll be like the first time. <laughs> She's committing suicide. That's literal suicide. The fuck have I done to my? What have I done to my menu NPC, dude? I fucking brick. I even got the worst ending of the menu, dude. Holy shit! What have I? What have I done? Holy shit, dude! I mean, fucking every. I mean, that's literally I just made a commit suicide. What? What the fuck? Jesus Christ! I would have this effect on people in real life, man. Uh, heck ass, dude. I, I'm a very logical person, and I, I acted the way I th felt like I would have acted in real life, right? I felt like, at least I thought I believe, you know. It's one of these things where, like, I, I, <laughs> my, my actions, I mean, they were pretty, I don't know if I necessarily believed the way they acted. I mean, the reason why Hank killed himself was it had nothing to do with me. End of the day. Yes, there was a world where I could have convinced him not to kill himself, probably somehow, but I just, I just did, you know. I mean, that was the son who's all fucked up. Push him over the edge. Okay. Um. Fuck! I want to know more about the the cy the cyber life guy. Wait, is there a way you can just go to the? Is there a way you can just go to a particular one and do it? Oh my god, this game, this game is crazy. What happens here? Oh, you can literally load checkpoint.
But still, I can go back. Midnight train, public enemy. Wait, where am I looking for? Save Kara. I could go back and change the change history. Wouldn't this be nice if we could do this in real life? Whenever you made a bad decision, you could just go back in time and fix it. Wait, I can't see the part that I was looking for. Wait, midnight. Wait, so how does that work? Wait, can you show legends? Search dialogue, cross path, cross track to impact. Dude, this is complicated. This is complicated. Holy shit. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Too much. Holy. Playing three hour trash game for a week. Okay, that's toxic. This game is not trash. Okay, for starters. They explore some really interesting concepts. Uh, it was like like we got to watch a sci-fi movie, right? It's like we get to watch a sci-fi movie, but we get to play the sci-fi movie. Um, just watch the endings. I just want to go back to that one place and not shoot the android. Is that easy to do, or is that not easy to do? Is that like is that difficult? Oh, meet Kamsky. Wait, there it is. How am I fucking missing that? Wait for Kamsky. The Kamsky test. Don't you guys want to see the other Kamsky test? Don't you want to see what happens here? You don't. You don't give a fuck. You don't give a fuck. I mean, wait. Everyone. Wait. I mean, Chad. I mean, uh, how many? I suppose ninety percent of you guys have seen this, right? 90% of you guys have seen this. Haven't you? Damn it. Whatever, dude. I might look into it off stream. Fuck you, you fucking head. Okay, let's watch the other innings. I'm watching the other innings before we do anything else. Okay, where's the other innings? Look that shit up. What the fuck? No, I can't do that. Oh my god. What the fuck? No shot. I like. Do you know what? I like that there's so many innings. That's cool. Because that means like you're just not gonna see it all, right? Like, and you, and everyone had their own different journey. I think that's how it should be. Uh. Hmm. That's too much. Is there not like a major ending? Can we not see can we not see the major endings? Best ending. Best ending. Everyone survived successful Android Revolution. Okay. Alright, let's do it. Let's do let's do the best ending. Let's do the best ending. Your friend's life is in your hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. What the fuck? Him or the revolution? Oh, what the Don't fuck? Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. Oh shit, what the fuck? I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. But I'm not a deviant. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. Oh shit. I'm sorry, Hank. You shouldn't have got mixed up in all this. Forget about me. Do what you have to do. Enough talk. It's time to decide who you really are. Are you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? All right. All right. You win. Oh, shit. Just convert the androids now. Just convert them all. Oh fuck, they know Kung Fu, dude. Look at this shit, they know Kung Fu. 
They know fucking kung fu. Okay. Right. Thanks, Hank. I don't know how I would have managed without you. Oh fuck, classic. Get rid of him. We have no time to lose. Classic. It's me, Hank. I'm the real Connor. Oh shit. One of you is my partner. The other is a sack of shit. Question is who's who? Can the deviant prove it? What are you it? doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Give me the gun and I'll Don't take care move. of you. Move. Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. Yeah, it's a classic. It's the one you do. That's that's the way of doing it. Where do we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. It's not gonna work. It needs to be something recent. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? Just look at him. Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. I. Son, what's his name? Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Oh shit, that's what happened. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. There you go. I was wondering. I think one of us. I thought a android fucked his wife. I'll be honest, and that he just lost his. You know, his wife divorced him because of a, a fucking. The android dick was too good. Responsible for your son's death. Or that. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who. Oh shit, bro. Oh shit. Yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. This would be a good TV Maybe series, you really man. To make the world a better place. Go ahead, do what you got to do. I mean, it's sure, I mean, it's a good story, regardless. I mean, to be fair, maybe it's better in the in the medium of a of a computer game. Oh, shit, let's go to interconnect them all. Let's get one to grab the other, to grab the other, to grab the other. Shit! Wake up! Wake up! Hey, wake! wake. Up. Wake up, wake up. That's wake surgical up, wake proliferation, Chan. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. This is what I said they should do. Wake up. Which is why I don't know why they didn't do it in the first place. Like, I would have. The revolution in the third. Had I been able to control the game properly, I would have. Uh, the cause of revolution. <laughs> like that, bro. Then again, the game would have ended instantly. <laughs> we done that. No, Chad. No. Would not have ended the world. So they got a passport and they got onto the bus. Excuse me, what's going on? Border control. All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. <laughs> How would they not instantly recognize, like, surely their fucking, like, scanner fucking helmets with all this fancy shit would recognize, like, a mass-produced model. They're, like, they're literally all mass-produced androids, and it can't detect them instantly. Like, I'm sorry, but... This way, please. CCTV nowadays can, like, tell who you are just from the bone structure of your face. They don't even need to see your eyes or anything. They, 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 they have, like... Your cheeks can identify you. L legit. Your point. Uh, that's what I'm saying. And they can't obviously detect androids. We're doing temperature checks. We're trapped. What do we 
you gonna do, Kara? Don't worry, Alice. We'll be fine. Okay, Rita. I'm just being realistic here. Okay? Just being realistic. We can't get through, Kara. We both know that. I'll think of something. There's got to be a way out of this. Oh, shit. We can't let them stop us. Not that we're so close. All that matters now is you and Alice. I can save you, Kara. No. No, we'll find another way. If there's no other way, I'll do it. Fuck, was there a six in with the life to save us, Carl? Next, please. If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Rose. Okay. Like, what is the point of this fancy helmet? When China current, like, yeah, 2021 CCTV cameras can tell you, uh, attribute points to you automatically. I mean, have you not seen this, the, uh, social credit system in China they have? They can, like, tell who you are, and then when you litter, you, like, get demerit points. Or, like, if you jaywalk, you lose points. I mean, uh, and a mass produced android can't be detected but in 20, 2038. When they've developed like sentient androids, I'll, I'm sorry. I'm so glad you're safe. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified. I thought you might have been killed. Thank God you're all right. You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I... Yo. Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there, too. There's no, there's no thing as a fat android. What if they just, like, put some pillows under their shirts? They'd be like, yo, oh, they're fat. You don't need to check them. Because they're fat, right? Think about it. There's no way she, Rose can be an android because she's so fucking fat. You'll be safe with Think him. Think about it. Think about it. What's happening with Marcus? He's protesting peacefully outside one of the android camps. Whatever happens now, he's already made the history books. Shit. Should I have done that, chat? Rose. Did they did not give me enough evidence that the peaceful protests were working. From my eyes, it was like, oh, the peaceful protests were doing nothing, and they're literally sending androids to death camps to slaughter them. Okay. If anything should happen... They didn't I'll show me back. anything. There was literally one bit of information. You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are going to meet them on the other side. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have it said public opinion supported me after I had made the decision to do a revolution, you dumb bitch. If that scene had been beforehand, I would have been fucking fine, bro. You fucking pussy. After. It was after. That interview was after, you dumb cunts. No, I'm not wrong. Go check the VOD, you fucking moron. You know what they'll do if they catch you.
I'm not convinced that fucking. Uh, I'm not convinced that the daughter is um, actually sentient. I think she, her programming is she's supposed to be a daughter, and she's supposed to be like. You never leave me, right, mommy? I love you. Yeah, I, I don't understand why my mother wanted to help you guys. Really? Seeing what Marcus is doing. That's what she's programmed to do. She was right. Cause Chad, how can you tell the difference if someone's pretending to be sentient versus actually being sentient? Like, if you can't tell the difference, what, like, you know, what? Like, if you literally, how, like, how do you know every single person you're interacting with in real life isn't just a fucking NPC pretending to be another person? Really? How do you know? You don't know. They could all just be NPCs. You could ask them complex questions, but they could just be really believable. You're alive. Public opinion. What is this clip? What is this? What is this trash? Wrong. You're linking some fucking thing that doesn't even exist, you dumb cunt. Dude, they're literally ex mass exterminating us. They're oh, what? I'm not looking at some interface option, you dumb cucks. I'm not looking at some fucking interface option. I don't care about that. What I care about is what I've seen, what I've saw in the news, what I've seen in the media. No, what, what is the reality? The reality is they're literally sending us to fucking death camps. And the press aren't even that upset about it. Like, dude, no, the reality was they're sending us to fucking death camps. You know what happens at death camps, dude? Okay? They literally slaughter people. To, like, uh, uh, you deserve to be free. I just... I don't make my decisions off some interface option in a computer game, chat. I make it based on the emotions that I'm feeling and what I'm... What, you know, the information that I'm receiving from the computer game. Not, not this fucking interface public opinion oh, being people support. realize that one day. You know? Okay. Oh, shit. I don't like when people do that, where they hold the line. Make a decision. Suck for myself. Next, please. What was the decision she made? I didn't say. Okay. ID, please. Are you fucking dumb clowns? You, what is this trash bam? What are you talking? I mentioned emotion is, uh, uh, yes, that is one small factor. That is one, like, is one small factor. Okay, what are the emotions of the people, you dumb cunts? The people. Everyone's like, fuck androids. They're, they're showing no remorse. We're sending them, handing your android. So we can send them to a camp and we can fucking destroy them. Can, did, 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 was, there like, was there any hint? Of them feeling bad for what they're doing? No. Were, were they, was there any outrage? No. That Not at all, you dumb... I'm talking about the emotions of the other people. You fucking morons. Holy shit. Like, I, what are you clowns even saying? Please. No shot, bro. Welcome to Canada. Oh, the Canadians. Look at this good PR for Canadians, dude. Really? They just let him throw?
That's his only job, and he's failing in it. Right. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the Deviants were protesting peacefully. Have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviants' demonstration by force this time. Oh my god. So they didn't give a fuck. They're not giving a fuck at all. North! Imagine just sitting there and just trying to not die. The best you do, that's all you do, you just stand there like running around just trying to not get shot. It's like a game of tag, except they've got fucking fully automatic rifles. Like you just lose eventually. Yeah. I understand. Androids were literally killing humans, though. Like that's like how half the origin stories of the defeat of androids was they were they thought they were gonna die, so they killed them. And so why wouldn't they be self-defending by killing humans now? The sex scene. I thought she didn't like the piece though. Sir, they're fornicating. You don't understand. The androids are having sex with each other. Down. Fuck that bitch, dude. That's the other reason I fucking kill you, man. Heartless. Now she, now she, all she just sees, just kissing. At dawn today, November 11th, 2038, thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the Deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain. The events in Detroit the fuck you linking have changed now? the world forever. The fuck you linking? May God bless you, and may God bless the United I've States seen the of engine. America. Okay. Hail the Emperor. You did it, Marcus. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. Who's the actor of Marcus? I feel like I've seen him in some shit.
They want you to speak to them, Marcus. Fuck it, they all live, dude. Oh my god, how many of my guys died, bro? What the fuck? How do you get, dude, what? How did you not lose those guys? They said it shot, they just shot that guy at the, at the protest. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We've suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Oh shit. That's getting mind control. What the fuck's this? What the fuck's this? There she is. Feels cold. Amanda? Amanda! What's... What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Resume control? You, you can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. Amanda! There's got to be a way. I mean, hit it to AoE mind control everyone back, dude. By the way. Right, like. Okay. There's a lot of depth, eh? A lot of, a lot of shit. Yeah, I wish I could have seen more about that character. The creator of Cybernet was fucking focused. And tell humans who we really are. What's happening in the real world? To tell them that we are people too. What's killing? What's killing? Marcus gonna do? In fact, we're a nation. What's that gonna do? Look, that's just gonna reinforce their beliefs, like. It's gonna fuck, like, I mean, really. Today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. Oh shit, fam, you need to hurry the fuck up, bro. You need to run, boy, run! Forget our bitterness and bandage our wounds. Where we forgive our enemies. Humans are both our creators and our oppressors, and tomorrow we must make them our partners. Like that's it? Maybe even one day our friends. He did it. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. We are alive, and now, we are free! I think it wasn't our move. They're not like, yeah, doing a great example of showing how alive they are, right? I feel like this has got to be a coding thing. They ran out of budget in the final scene. Oh, 
Oh, the true ending. To be fair, I feel sad that I got these guys killed. I don't really feel bad about my other endings. It's awful. Right? Alice. But like... The fact that I just got these guys killed, and they just didn't make it. But in another universe they made it, so it's fine. I feel like if they had stayed, they, they would have also been safe. I mean, it looks like if they had stayed, they would have also been safe. Something they needed to go to Canada. Oh, shit. What if he won the bet? Are we still alive in this universe? Look. Hank's <laughs> not dead, dude. There it is. Poggies. That's pretty good. That's a great game. That's a great game. That's a good game, chat. That's a good game. Um, I'm not paying attention to the hard cut information on the screen. I'm basing it, it off my feelings. I'm retarded. Oh, shut the fuck up. I was showing the emotion of the other fucking characters. They were showing absolutely no remorse. It looked like, the, I mean, it looked like a Nazi regime. They're like, yeah, we're sending them to camps and we're destroying them. And everyone was like, yeah, 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 yeah. That wasn't like, that's fucked up. You can't do that. It was, it was like, no, we're just doing that. And that's the way it is. Um, and there was no there was no conversation or discussion about the fact that I had a peaceful protest. Actually, it was the opposite. There was misinformation being spread about how, like, we attacked and did all this shit when I didn't attack. So it's like, hmm, question mark, dude. Secret camp. Oh, this, this is, the wait, what the fuck, dude? So what happens if Kara and Marcus yes. die, and Connor we'll here, doesn't find Jericho. We'll well, right away, this happens. Enjoy. Okay, yep. Chat, war my son. Okay, so they get caught. But he's gonna not escape, you just don't hide. Come on. A little one is gone. Well, I can't have just disappeared. You've gotta be here somewhere. What are you waiting for? Go look. See? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Jesus Christ! <laughs> that what? <laughs> oh no! Quit me a bit. Oh shit! It's crazy that they even made loose conditions for this. Oh Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh wow, they shoot him in the head there? No. No. We have to go north. No, no. We have to go. They shoot him in the head there. Oh, Jesus, okay. Alright, Max is dead. Oh, so they literally kill everyone off. Oh, so they get Marcus killed. What, they just... Your mission is over. It's time to return to cyber life. Wait! I can solve this case! So this if you failed to solve time. it. It's too late, Connor. You failed. 
Oh, Jesus. So this is like the absolute worst ending. Oh, I didn't get this ending, bitch, so fuck you, chat. That's what that's what you get if you would suck at computer games, which I don't suck at. Connor T Connor was Following the dramatic scenes in Detroit yesterday, the FBI have confirmed that the android known as Marcus was destroyed. Our sources indicate that it was a rare prototype. One that belonged to the famous painter, Carl Manfred, who died recently. The FBI raided an abandoned freighter in Detroit at 10.45 p.m. yesterday. Thousand androids were destroyed or captured. Our forces are now combing the streets to ensure that none got through the net. We are going to find them one by one and destroy them. Fuck it now. camps in most major cities to gather and destroy androids. So far, camps have been installed in Los Angeles, Chicago, whiskey, Denver, Houston, Boston, San Francisco, and of course, Detroit. President Warren announced today that android collection and destruction operations were fully underway, but that it will take at least a week to eliminate the current generation of machines. CyberLife issued a statement today saying that it is working closely with the authorities in order to round up and destroy all androids across the country. They also announced an internal investigation to identify the malfunction and to prevent any such incidents in the future. Oh shit, this is like the humans win. Elijah Kamsky, you're the founder of CyberLife and foremost expert on androids. Though you left CyberLife years ago, you've just been reappointed as CEO in the wake of the dramatic events in Detroit. How do you feel about what happened there? Clearly what happened in Detroit was a tragedy. Artificial intelligence is a wonderful tool, provided it can be controlled. Fortunately, CyberLife managed to quickly produce a solution to the demon problem. Under my management, we'll take every precaution to prevent such a thing from ever happening again. Can you assure us that androids no longer pose a threat? Absolutely. There was an incident, but we've learned from our mistakes. And we can assure you that androids will remain exactly what they were designed to be. Obedient and efficient machines. How do you respond to those who point out the social impact of androids, especially in terms of unemployment? Well, of course, that's absurd. We heard the same objections when the steam engine first appeared. True. Nobody today would dream of living without electricity. Who wants to turn their back on progress? True. Some are questioning whether androids have become a new intelligence and that we destroyed them without listening to their message. How do you respond to that? Cyberlife's androids imitate life to perfection. But they'll never be alive. I understand that some people may be fooled. But they're only an imitation. Nothing else. Mr. Kamsky, thank you very much. You're welcome. Mm. Well, there you go, dude. Okay. My duckly balloons? Fuck you, bitch. This doesn't make you a chad. That makes you a fucking little pussy cuck with a tiny dick, bro. That's what makes you. That's what makes you. It makes you a little pussy bitch. A little pussy bitch. The worst ending. Wait, this is the worst ending? There's too many endings! What the fuck is that? Oh, bro, I can't, I can't, like, dude, I mean, that's like, that's clickbait, man. The most horrifying and depressing ending. Wait, what the fuck is that, dude? Wait, what the fuck? Dude, I got it. I've got it. I've got it. Let me see if I can skip past some of it, though, to get to it. Where are they taking us? Oh, they, sh they went to the camp? They're going to the camp? I don't know how this is. This, oh, is this going to the they're going to the chambers. Come on, get out! Get a move on! Out! Oh Jesus. Moving! What are you doing? Hey! 
hands on your heads! Line up with the others, right now! Oh, Jesus. And they used to like tie people together and then they would uh, they would shoot them in the head. Forward. Like there was there was strats, or they would weigh them down with bricks and then push them into water, right? I they were like yeah, it was There's no choice, Alice. They were like saving ammunition. Next. No, Cara. I I can't. Ugh. You just have to go through the gate. There's nothing to be scared of. I'll be right behind you. I was fucked up, man. You first. You really need to do this. Just do it for me, please. For unleash. Come on, it's your turn. Break out. Break out. Oh, this is this is a depressing ending where they don't break out though. I don't know if I want to watch this. This is going to be just fucking... This is just the recycle area, dude. Ugh. Deactivate your skin. Hurry up. in the dumpster. This is sad as fuck, on, dude. This is just way. fucking depressing. Move on. This is fucking depressing. You, take this one of a dump. No, no, please, I beg you. I gave you an order. Obey now. I beg you, please don't kill me. and make it snappy. Right away, sir. Forward! Come on, get moving! You, over there! No, wait, we're together! Over there, I said! The dehumanite... Ah! Well, that's fucked up, man. I mean, they're just robots. So the humans. To be fair, though, we're just assuming they're sentient. Alice! Get out of here! Want to die? Please, let me out! Oh, I Alice. Get out. oh God! I haven't done anything wrong. Let me out! Alice! It could just be like a, you know, they could just be trying to imitate. Oh wow, he made it here. I want to get out. No doubt about it, it's Kara. I want to get out. Of course, Kara got captured too. That's really just too bad, really too bad. Have you seen the little girl who was with me? Obviously, the little girl is a prisoner here, just like Ralph. Ralph doesn't want to die. No, Ralph doesn't want to die. Do not move and remain silent. Obey now. Ralph doesn't want to die. Ralph doesn't want to die. Listen, Ralph. Ralph dies. Oh, yes. You have to keep calm. Otherwise, the humans will hurt you. You understand? No. 
Ralph killed a few humans, but it was in self-defense. Yes, it was in self-defense. Self-defense. Look at me, Ralph. Nobody's gonna hurt you. You just have to stay calm. Okay? Ralph hasn't seen the little girl. No. Ralph hasn't seen her. Jerry? Kara? So they captured you too. They came to take out the Jerry's. They separated us. But it's all gonna work out, isn't it? Oh, God. Do you know where Alice is? Oh, God. Alice? The little one? We know, y yes. We think we saw her. Carl, if we can help in any way, just ask. We have to save the little one. What's behind these doors? Carol! I thought I'd never see you again. Wait, why shouldn't they have android we dicks? Separated. Alice is alone. In here. We have to find her. Right? Because I mean they're sex robots, right? You, you, and you over this way. And you. Come on, get a move on. I'm just saying. No, Luther. I mean dicks aren't just skin. Chet, that's the the sex robots. I guess it would have just been too distracting. Alice. They probably they probably Prototype with the Android dicks. No, leave him alone. Don't worry. Uh. It'll be your turn soon. It's an add on for the Android dicks. I'll get an add on for Android. Oh my god. I remember you. He saved us from the master's house. So you were captured too? The humans found us. They said we were monsters. They killed most of us. Put the others in trucks and brought us here. Oof. Why have they gathered us all together like this? What are they going to do? Listen. Do you hear that? Wouldn't they all be waking up right now, considering that they're the all girl I was with. about Have to die? Her? No. No, she's not here. They are, I mean, a lot of them are waking up, but a lot of them are not. A lot of them are just obediently standing there and just chilling. to find Alice. Do you know where she is? You stay here. We come back soon. Cara! Alice! Are you okay? Oh, are they gonna fray oh, it? Just to... I don't like this place. We have to get out of here. Come on. Move along. Come on. You no, too. She can get through the hell. Leave her alone! Leave her alone! Cara!
I see. So we're tr so they're trying to free us right now. So we're like we just gonna we just gonna stall until they get here. Although. Step forward when you hear the signal. You got it. I don't want to tell you to take time. Come on, let's go. Move. like a um, cattle getting slaughtered I don't know what's behind those doors but none of us will come out alive you've got to go see Alice you've got to reassure her what's reassuring Alice Kara no Alice don't move but I'm scared But you have to trust me. Stay where you are, okay? Whatever happens, don't move. Don't leave me alone. I see. So that she's trying to keep her chill, so she doesn't freak out. So she freaks out. She gets shot. I can help you, Carl. I can attract the guard's attention. Ralph's about to die. A great pity if Ralph died. That was us for sure. A great pity. Great pity. Ralph is fucking gonna spug out, isn't he? God! We can't. We didn't do anything. Oh, the sick fuck. I can help you, Kara. I can attract the guard's attention. <laughs> Fucking everyone's trying to help her. Everyone's trying to help her, dude. They're just not. Oh, God. I want you to hold me. Don't leave me all alone. There's nothing we can do. We've got to be brave. Jesus Christ, is that the watch? Anxiety, dude. Clara, I was so scared. Are you alright? Come on, move it. Okay, just dude, this better not be the dying one. He better, he better, they better save them. They better save them. Oh, don't tell me they lost. Don't tell me they lost. Oh, don't tell me they lost the fight. I think he just, I think what happened is it cut back to Marcus and he intentionally lost the fight with Marcus. Ralph? Of course Ralph doesn't want to die. But he doesn't want the little girl to die either. Oh, fuck. Ralph can help you to escape. You only have to ask Ralph and Ralph will help you. They'll kill you if you try anything. Ralph knows that. But if the little girl is free, it's a little bit like if everyone was free. Ralph isn't scared. The little girl's life's more important. I mean, it's not a little girl, it's another android. You're another android, dude. You you all live you're all immortal. She's got some light of program. I can attract the guard's attention. 
Like. It would make sense if they were humans. I won't let them kill you, Cap. I won't let them destroy the only people I love. Oh, shit, man. No, Luther. You can't sacrifice yourself. We'll find another way. If there's no other way, I'll do it. Why don't they coordinate a fucking attack where everyone attacks at the same time and they fucking overthrow the guards, dude? Fuck, dude. I mean, seriously, there's like 500 of them, and they're all like super advanced androids. They can communicate, you know, via wireless. Be like, all right, just fucking convert. All right, attack. Oh, oh my god, he's just walking in? Luther! You're the most extraordinary person I've ever met, Alice. I was just a machine. You made me part of a family. Don't be scared. This isn't the end. That's just straight up depressing. The city just like, systematically dismantling all the characters. Don't, I mean, the Quinny. This is a fucking terrible. I would not do this. This person's a sick fuck. The person who went to this ending is a sick fuck. Why are we watching this? What the fuck? All right, and they get saved, and they get saved, and they get saved. And they get saved. God damn, dude, what the fuck, bro? They don't get dismantled there. I guess I guess. Oh fuck. Is that another ending? Is that just another ending? I, don't, I guess it was another ending. Oh my god, bro. Jesus Christ. Why the 
fuck will you watch that? Holy shit, bro. Oh, that was fucking... Alright, okay. Well, yeah, there you go, chat. Alright. Don't lose the game, dude. It'll fu that'll fuck you up. That'll fuck you up, dude. Holy fuck. You guys think this is like real life, chat? This is like real life. Because, like, you know, there's infinite possibilities, and you're just going down one set, you know, and then, you know, these other, like, there's other, there's other parallel universes where these other things, these awful, awful things are happening. Um, and there's other people out there where awful things are happening to them, man, and you just, you know, you're going to be thankful for what you've got, chat, because, I mean, shit, bro. Uh Shit, man. Three. It's time, my brothers. You know what time it is, dude. You know what time it is, dude. It's balloons time. Although I feel fucking depressed, but then isn't that the even more of a reason to play balloons? Okay. I was thinking. About doing a challenge. Mm. I was 